Assam is a culturally and ecologically rich state which falls under two biodiversity hotspots, the Indo-Burmese and the Himalayan. The forests here shelter the highest primate diversity in India. Assam is among the few lucky states in India blessed with the presence of three langu species, of which the tiniest and the most elusive is found here in the Barag Valley. the fairy's leaf monkey. Come with us for a day out with the fairies. Barak Valley is a diverse landscape including plains, tropical evergreen, semi-evergreen, deciduous forests, tea plantations, secondary forests, monoculture orchards, wetlands and crop fields. Fairies leaf monkeys are primarily arboreal and cruise the canopy in search of food and shelter. It is a globally endangered primate as per the IUCN Red List and also protected as a Schedule 1 species under the Indian Wildlife Protection Act 1972. In India, the geographical distribution is confined to small, fragmented patches in the northeastern states of Tripura, Mizoram and Assam. They prefer tropical, semi-evergreen, deciduous and secondary forests. Thus, they are well suited to the Barak Valley. They are also found in bamboo forest where the plants provide food and shelter. These small slender langus have a striking distinguishing feature. A pallid white ring surrounding their mouth and eyes, which earned them their nickname Spectacled Monkey, locally known as Chashma Bandor and Kalahanuman. The goggle-eyed langoos are merely 55 to 65 centimeters in length, much smaller compared to the other two langoo species found in Assam, the golden langoos and the kept langoos. This is Thilbhum forest, adjoining the Hathikirasti state, one of the last few forest patches in the Barak Valley where the population of the fairy's leaf is increasing. Although this seems like a promising sign, the species is struggling due to habitat fragmentation. The habitat in many other reserve and community forests is shrinking rapidly. This is an alarming situation. Unlike the Rishis macaque, the fairies are not well adapted to human modified habitats. In the early decades of the 20th century, tea plantations increased deforestation, causing habitat fragmentation that affected several species. Additionally, activities like poaching, jhum cultivation, monoculture plantation, unplanned developmental activities and constructions have pushed many primate species like the fairy sleeve monkey to the brink of local extinction. In the forest fringes, timber logging is among the main factors that have led to gaps in the canopy, restricting the movement of species like the fairy's leaf monkey and isolating their troops to small pockets. Such areas need immediate attention 
from a conservation point of view. Despite rich forest cover, the only protected area in the region is the Borail Wildlife Sanctuary in the Kachar district. Isolating mechanisms and barrier formation that are taking place in these areas at a rapid rate can be addressed with the afforestation of food plants of the targeted primate species along with a proper restoration plan for the forest. Further destruction of forest areas can be prevented through awareness and people's participation. As the fairies leave monkeys are confined to only a few isolated pockets in some countries of Southeast Asia and threats in all such habitats are almost identical. Attention from the international conservation community and proper management of habitat by the concerned government bodies might help safeguard the future of this remarkable primate.